Please join me as I unbox a doll that was donated to DBG's Virtual Black Doll Museum by Lisa Tutu Souza. Tutu, the name that she's affectionately known by, is a Leo Moss inspired doll artist who sells dolls on eBay and through her Geranium Hills treasure shop on Ruby Lane. To help generate funds for the museum, Tutu made and donated this doll specifically for the museum to auction. Her generosity stems from her appreciation of the information the museum provides on antique, vintage, and modern black dolls. The proceeds of the upcoming auction will help defray the museum's annual administrative costs and other fees. The video serves to announce the upcoming February auction of the doll and to generate interest in the lovely one-of-a-kind doll that you and I are about to view for the first time. The doll is in this unopened box, as you can see, and I will open it shortly and we will both view it together. With scissors in, in my hand, I am going to open the box so that we can both see the contents. bubble wrap. There's a letter from Tutu that says, that reads, Aloha Debbie, in support of the Virtual Black Doll Museum, I am gifting you this Leo Moss art doll, Lily, that I created. I appreciate you with, with Aloha Tutu. Here's the letter. And um, I named the doll Lily um, because I wanted it to be named after the man who inspired the doll's creation, Leo Moss. Packed in tissue paper. Make sure that I've gotten everything out of the box. I'll move the box aside. And we will see, have her upside down, we will see Lily together for the first time. She has a disposable diaper around her head to protect her during her travel. And there she is. Lily, isn't she adorable? The hair and everything is like Leo Moss's style, including the inset eyes, which are glass. And on her chest, there is um, a cloth name tag that has her name, Lily, and the artist's name, she is number 117 of the artist dolls, not 117 of Lily, but uh, Tutu has made a total of 117 Leo Moss style dolls, and she is from Honolulu, Hawaii. And Lily has a hang tag with her, with um, the Leo Moss's first doll, Mina, an image of her, the first doll that introduced Leo Moss's dolls to the doll collecting community. Mina is on the front of the hang tag. Tutu is the proud owner of Mina, Mina now. And then on the back, the hand tag reads, Leo Moss inspired handmade doll Lily by Tutu Souza, 
Honolulu, Hawaii. So as I said, if you're not already a follower of DBG's virtual Black Doll Museum, become a follower now so that you can stay abreast of the uh, details of the auction which will be held in February. And you don't want to miss this because it will be your opportunity to own a Leo Moss inspired doll that is made under the uh, using the same techniques as Leo Moss used to make his dolls which now sell for several thousand dollars. But this will be your opportunity to get a doll, a similar doll, for a fraction, a mere fraction of the cost. This is Lily. Stay tuned. Follow, follow the museum. Thanks for watching.